Dexcom 1 is a continuous glucose monitoring tool for managing diabetes and we are going to show you how straightforward it is to get started. First, let's look at the three components that make up the Dexcom 1. The applicator with built-in sensor, the transmitter, and your compatible smartphone for displaying the data. The sensor applicator inserts the sensor just beneath your skin. The sensor then measures your glucose levels for up to 10 days. Once the sensor is inserted, the transmitter is clicked into place and sends glucose data to your Dexcom 1 app every five minutes. Your transmitter lasts for up to three months. Your smartphone shows where your glucose is at and which direction it is heading. You can also set up optional glucose alerts. Those are the components. Now, let's show you how to get started. The Dexcom 1 box contains a sensor, transmitter and your instructions for use. The first thing you need to do is download the Dexcom 1 app. Then, either log in or if you have never had an account with Dexcom, create an account first. The app walks you through the entire setup process, step by step. You will see an overview to learn how Dexcom 1 works. You will set up connectivity in the app. And you will insert your sensor and pair your transmitter. Back to the app. After login, the app shows you an overview of how the Dexcom 1 works. Read these screens to learn everything you need to know about Dexcom 1. Dexcom 1 offers alerts that let you know when your glucose has gone too high or low. You will come to a screen where you can turn these alerts on or off. Let's turn the alerts on. You always have the option to turn them off later. Read the information about readings, alerts, treatment decisions and safety. The app will then walk you through connecting your phone. You will need to enable Bluetooth and allow notifications. Enter your transmitter serial number. The serial number can be found on the bottom of your transmitter box. Enter your sensor code. The sensor code is on the sensor applicator. Then, the last step is to insert your sensor and pair your transmitter. The app will provide instructions on how to do this. To insert your sensor, choose a place on your belly or the back of your arm. If you are under 18, you have the option to place it on your upper buttocks as well. Avoid sites with irritated skin, bones, tattoos or areas that get bumped. Before you begin, wash your hands. Then clean your skin with rubbing alcohol and let it dry. Peel off the adhesive backing. Place the applicator on your skin. Fold and break off the safety guard. Press the button to insert the sensor. Remove the applicator. You have now successfully inserted your sensor. Your sensor will last for up to 10 days. Now it's time to attach your transmitter. Clean your transmitter with an alcohol wipe and let it dry. Insert the transmitter. Tab first into the holder. Click the transmitter firmly into place. Rub around the patch three times. The transmitter is now attached. You'll reuse this same transmitter for three months. Back on the app, confirm you have inserted your sensor and attached your transmitter. Wait for your transmitter to pair and start the sensor warm-up. The warm-up will take two hours to complete and you will not receive readings during this time. Keep your smartphone close to you, within six meters during warm-up. That's how straightforward it is to get started on Dexcom 1.